Go for your Eight, robot needs, they'll only seven, make you one. Six, five, four, three, two, one. Fight, robots, fight. Drunken peasant. Doing a cautious box, box rush there. Drunken peasant having no issues at all crossing the box and bringing it straight to Luke Quinn. Wow. Oh, and you can hear that egg beater on Drunken Peasant just humming. Now, I haven't seen the weapon on Troll Toll do much yet. No, and that's pretty much half of their drivetrain as well. So they're, they're in kind of rough straights right now. Not able to do any real control on the movement without that weapon going. The Troll Toll is a very interesting design. Obviously, I would love to talk about it. Um, but there, there, there it goes. It's very slowly spinning, that, that weapon at the end of Troll Toll. Looks like big TPU gears on there. Is that what that is? That's right. Yeah, yeah that's printed cool. gears. Now, Drunken Peasant uh, doesn't look like its weapon is, is running, or perhaps Sol has simply turned it off and waited for, uh, for Luke to, uh, to get back on its feet. But it doesn't right look now, like Troll yeah. Toll is running. No, right now Troll Toll is just kind of spinning on one particular axis, the, uh, and I have one particular axis, the weapon axis over there on that side. And now we're the ref is uh, down. It's calling, calling for Troll Toll to, uh, to start showing motion. Hey, Whoa! There you go. Okay. Oh, and it's back. And the weapon's fully functional. With a minute twenty-two to go. Oh, which is more than enough yes. time. This is this is the troll toll that I was waiting to see. But I don't hear the weapon on Drunken Peasant. I think that that weapon might be down. Yeah, that weapon's got to be all the way down. And that's all we got from Troll Toll. Hey, they were able to self right. Look at that. Weapon's still not going. We'll see how that goes. We got 50 minutes left in this fight. Or 50 seconds left in this fight, rather. Yeah, the weapon on the end of Troll Toll is not running. This is this is the time where Luke wants to run this weapon, but uh, really this is just uh, just a single single wheel from Sunny Robotics just smashing into a uh, to drunken peasant. It looks great, but probably not that destructive. No, definitely not. Now Sol has just pushed Troll Toll into the corner. This is a. Uh, it's not a pin because it's active, but uh, I don't think Troll Toll will be able to get out of this. Hard to get much of anywhere on only one wheel. Yeah. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. That's the match. Drive to the doors. Oh, they've already driven to the doors, Kyle. How nice. Yeah, that was very convenient. We're going to well save done. some time. All right, we're going to go to the judges here. This went the full three minutes. Very strange design versus a super classic design. And uh, we saw why it was a classic. It ran pretty well. Yeah. All right. I would love to get your thoughts. Troll Toll versus Drunken Peasant, starting with you, Andrew. Yeah, definitely an interesting match, uh, to say the least. I think Drunken Peasant really... Um, was able to control the fight um, and was able to control when um, Troll Toll was able to move. And once Troll Toll st started to show motion, even though their weapon was not working, they were able to stay on them. And yeah, I really limit that mobility. So that's going to be a vote for Drunken Peasant. Is that right? Oh, that's Drunken Peasant. Yep. All right, perfect. How about you, Jack? Yeah, I'm also going to give my vote to Drunken Peasant. They were just in full control of the fight the entire time, and even when the weapon stopped, they just kept on top of Troll Toll and didn't give them a chance. All right, it came down to control for Jack, and I absolutely agree. How about you, Don? Drunken Peasant versus Troll Toll. Yeah, Drunken Peasant just stayed on him the entire time, and even whenever uh, Troll Toll had an opportunity to try to recover it was always struggling so got to get it to drunk peasant all right we've got a unanimous judge's decision for drunken peasant soul yep. remains alive in the loser's bracket for 12 pound action well deserved
And uh, Troll Toll, super interesting design, but going back to Colorado with two losses under its belt. Understandably so. They just weren't really able to get that weapon fully functional. Plus, you know, the giant fire in that last fight wasn't super helpful. Yeah, that's true. Yeah. Yeah. First fire, only fire so far today. <laughs> Pretty big one, too. It yeah. was nice. It uh, was nice. All right. Loading into box one, we've got Tiefschlag versus Vertigo. Losers bracket round two. Three pound bots 